Hey guys, Smokey here, bringing you part two to our World Edit World Guard tutorial. Today, I'm going over World Edit, and so anyway, you should already have World Edit downloaded if you watched the last tutorial. If not, there will be a little link in the video here. Click on that, go to the last one, and it will be on World Guard. These plugins are very, very much tied together, and you must have both in order for it to get the full operating power you want. So anyway, World Edit has this simple one thing, config file in the folder, which I know very little about, so I'm going to go through only the things that I know. Right here, the limits it will deal with the brushes and the super pickaxe. So I'll explain what brushes are, and I'll actually kind of try and show you some of these commands in-game. Um, so anyway, that's that. Inventory, I couldn't tell you. Logging is where if you set the true, it'll create a file for your server and you can click on that file to see what all commands are being used on your server that have to deal with world edit. Super pickaxe is where if you change the pickaxe, or nah, if you type slash slash and then enter, you'll have a super pickaxe that can break through any block and it's cool. I use it all the time, it's very helpful. And it can even break through bedrock, so that's kind of cool too. Snapshots, I, I don't know. I guess if you take a snap, uh, snapshot, it'll direct it to somewhere, but I just don't even work on bother with that one. Navigation wand is, have if you've ever seen it or heard about it, it's the compass, because that's what it's set to. If you left-click with the compass, I believe it's left-click. Maybe it's right-click. No, I think it's left-click. <laughs> um... But if you left click anywhere, if you're just looking at a far distance, you left click, you'll teleport to that location. Cool. It's very cool. Default is max, the max distance default is 100, but I set it to 500, so we can go teleport even farther. Scripting, couldn't tell you. Saving, I don't really know what that is. History, couldn't tell you. Wand is, um, I can't really, I don't know what that is. I could look that up, but I don't really know. Like I said, I know very little about this config file. And here is the permissions if you don't, uh, how you set up permissions for World Edit if you don't have a permissions plugin already set up, which I do, so don't worry about that. Sorry, I apologize, guys. I don't really know much about the config file. In fact, World Edit is still actually a very challenging plugin for me, which is why right now I'm going to look up World Edit commands. So let me pull that up here. And then we'll go to Minecraft, and I'll kind of demonstrate some of what or what World Edit can do for you. So anyway, I, before while we're waiting here, like in World Guard, you saw me uh, create uh, a protected region. You saw me spawn glass on that region and whatnot, and. It's very useful. It's very useful for deleting certain objects, typing slash air like I did. It's good for pretty much anything like that nature. Um, so anyway, oh God, he's already wanting me. Hold on, guys, just so I don't get spammed here. All right. So here we go. Let's go ahead and type. If you type slash wand slash slash wand, it should get. Oh, it's gonna give you the. I don't even know what that does, honestly, guys. Okay, I'm not gonna deal with that. <laughs> um, uh, let's go to something I know. Uh, replace. I showed you these already. These are world edit commands. I showed you those. Um, smooth is where if you want to make the uh, land like you if you uh, make an area and you make a big part of land you take out like half of a mountain and you want that to look a little bit more natural looking you can smooth it out with slash slash smooth um, it's very useful I use it a lot um, in fact I'll show you here Oops. right over here this region as you can tell was uh, flattened out and you can see half this wall here is kinda there so slash slash smooth oh you know what here instead of slash slash smooth type slash slash brush smooth and then it'll pull up a little thing right down here keep that do not uh, 
for this is for a Mac though, guys. So I don't know if it does that for PS or PC. Um, but do not get rid of that because what will end up happening is the server will shut down. I did that earlier uh, yesterday and it shut down. And I was like, what the heck just happened? So uh, anyway, guys, as you can tell, I'm smoothing out this region. It's kind of creating a little bit more of a mountain-looking idea here, and uh, that's what I'm going for. Um, so, oh, whoa, whoa. It does do a little bit weird stuff sometimes like that, but as you can tell, it looks a little bit more natural than what it did before with just the blank wall. So I use it because it's pretty cool looking. It just kind of helps out. Um, I want to plug up this hole, but it doesn't seem to want to do that, does it? All right. And so if I say, like, you have a situation like this, you can just go with the wand here, the uh, wood axe set, grass, and voila, you're covered. Uh, except for that part. There we go. Oh, wow. I am just out of it, aren't I? There we are. Much better. All right. So that's the brush. So, okay. Uh, let's go over here. What is water doing in this desert? Well, desert doesn't normally have water. So if we want to get rid of this water, we can do it multiple ways. You can do it with slash slash drain. And let's do 15. Oh, where did the water go? It dried up. So pretty much I just drain the water within the radius of 15 blocks. So 15 blocks around me, any water around me would have been drained. Another way to get rid of water, and as you can see, the, this water also was drained. But I don't want that to be drained, so slash slash undo and... Oh, maybe that region was did not have water, did it? Nope, that's what had water. This is just an empty little hole. <laughs> um... So if you another way to drain water is to type in slash slash remove and this actually works with anything really you can uh, remove any block near you I want to remove this water so remove near water and then the radius I'll say 10 and that water will disappear all right, so undo that. You can do that with that's the most effective way on getting rid of lava. So say you have lava towers everywhere, and you're like, oh god, I gotta get rid of these, and I, you gotta you're like trying to place all the blocks. I know how annoying it is because I've done it before. I had to clean that mess up before, but world edit. You go up to it and you type slash slash remove near lava, and then the radius and lava will disappear in 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 it, yeah. and it is the most wonderful sight you will ever see. <laughs> um. Anyway, that's one. Of, that's pretty much that. Uh, butcher, useful one, I guess. Uh, I can show you that. I'm only gonna go over the commands that I normally use on a regular basis, because um, these are the ones I know. So slash butcher kills all the mobs in the surrounding area, and it will kill no, uh, neutral, friendly, and hostile mobs. Um, SPA, that would be the super pickaxe, like I said before, if you type slash slash, it will give you super pickaxe, which is enabled now. If you want to disable, simply type slash slash again. Um, if you want SBA area, you can do that, but you need the radius as it says me there. So three, oh, well that didn't work, did it? S I typed SBA. Area three. There we go. All right, so left click, and whoa, whoa. <laughs> now we have a slightly smaller area, as you can tell. All right, or so now we can delete. Oops. You can do slash slash undo or slash undo. Doesn't matter. It's still the same thing. All right, and let's see. Tree slash tree. Yeah, hold on, let's just get rid of our super pickaxe here. Yep, see, I told you, he's spamming. He is spamming. <laughs> and I ignored him so he wouldn't. How did I know? All right, so tree and then the type of tree. Let's just do... Just doing slash tree will give you a normal tree. So it's bound to the time and pickaxe that I have in my hand. So left click. Oh, look, a tree. World edit, you can do almost anything with, and it's great. I love it. Um, 
you can do brushes, cylinder, that's what I was talking about earlier. Um, I did the brush smooth. I don't really use these too often. If you do that, you can you type the uh, brush, slash slash brush cylinder, then the item you want the brush to be, and then the uh, radius, it, I think it goes up like five, it's one through five, and then height, if you want the height. Um, and let's see what else is there. Uh, I guess that's what the snapshots are. If you want those to be directed to a uh, directory or whatever, but I don't do that. World Edit Reload, World Edit Version. Just that's pretty much all I can tell you right here. And not only that, but did I not just show you? But it also briefly explains each of the commands. So anyway, guys. Thank you for watching. Uh, I hope this helped you out a little bit. If you have any questions, uh, if they're simple, easy questions that I can simply answer off the bat, I'll respond to your comment. If you give me a question and I don't respond, it's either because I didn't get it or I just have no clue. Uh, I'll try my best to say, okay, I honestly don't have a clue <laughs> what that is or something like that. If you need help with something that's a little bit more complex than just a simple question, PM me on YouTube, email me, zman1227 at yahoo.com, Skype me, donuts, D-O-N-U-T-T-Z, hyphen, hyphen, and anyway, guys, have a nice day, and I'll see you in my next video. See ya.